So what we're looking at right now is the Holocaust Memorial in Vienna, the main Holocaust Memorial. We are here at Judenplatz. It used to be the former Jewish settlement in Vienna up until the first expulsion of Jews in 1421. Behind us over there, we can see the Jewish Museum and the Mizrahi House. Mizrahi, of course, means uh, East in Hebrew. And down there, if you go into the Jewish History Museum, you can see that they have excavations going down about three, four meters. We're looking around nine to 12 feet below ground excavations in the oldest synagogues in this area. It's quite an amazing site, definitely something to see. We can go take a look at that. The Holocaust Memorial behind us here is symbolism of a library because for the most part, many Jews are uh, learned people. They like to learn, they study the books, etc. And this is symbolism of Jewish life. However, it's been turned inside out. There are no doorknobs, no windows, nothing. All the books are on the outside. You don't even know which book you're looking at because the outside of the book is covered up. You don't see what's going on. It's quite of a symbolism of the lost communities of the six million approximately Jews of Europe, the concentration camps here, and the approximately 65,000 Austrian Jews that lost their lives during the Holocaust. There were about 200, 220 Jews in Austria up until 1938. Many of them were from the provinces of the former Austro-Hungarian Empire who immigrated to Vienna in uh, after World War I approximately and of them 65,000 again were murdered. The rest uh, made their way to Palestine, Israel, the United States, North America, South America and Shanghai.